What's up, everybody? Dan Diaz here, and welcome back to Ukulele. As I promised, we picked up right back where we left off. I am determined to beat this level before we end this episode right here. In fact, actually, I almost forgot to do something. Give me a second. There we go. Now we're ready. I set little timers for myself, so I know how long I've been playing. The fuck are you? Sorry, I've got no business with you, lizard. Hey. That's how you meant to do. Huh. Let's do this. Huh. Huh. Oh, I can't stand on you. Fine. Yeah. Hey. Nice. Oh, gosh. So, anyways, um, huh. I feel like there was something huh. I was saying before. Huh. Hey. The fuck is this? It's a sleeping totem. Ooh, that looks like a nasty fall. <laughs> I don't need to use my energy right here. I'm just fine. So, uh, I had to take a break after that last episode because my throat was really sore. So I did end up going, taking a second, walk around. It's not because my fish move. Step in my office. Very fantastic offer. Okay. So, but I did end up taking a bit of a break because I was I was pretty tired after that last one. Oh, fire! Oh, oh gosh, it's not looking good. And, and you know, it does look like the energy does regenerate itself. I, I don't know if it does or not. It didn't seem to give any impression that it did. I'm hearing something giggle. That distracted me. I hear you. The fuck? They're coming for me. Three! That takes two hits. Okay, if they have a glowing hat, it means it takes two hits. Hey, Piggy, where's Kermit? Oh, nom nom. Good day to you, young warriors. I stick with my previous statement. All the sounds these guys make sounds like they're all having sex. How about you've got a weight-related name? Go on, then. What is it? I come one. She's I'm a proud knight of Ham Ham a lot. Oh my gosh. I knew it. Carry on then. Tell us about your brave quest for treasure. Indeed. Once fellow knights and I are engaged in a daring hunt for the great Rampo's sacred treasure place. Um, no. For security reasons, we've split our search into four separate locations. However, one is currently feeling a little too burdened to locate them. Might thou assist in locating my fellow knights and the treasure? Sure, what the fuck. Don't worry, Scott's lot will help find your knights. Is is Yuka supposed to be a girl or a boy? I, I don't... I don't know. My first knight is your father, now to bestow a clue. My feet are wet, but do not fret. I won't drown by this corplet town. Uh -huh. Got it. We forget we'll come back and ask you again. My feet are wet, but don't you fret. I'll never drown in this corplet town. Okay? So I'm guessing it's somewhere by a water source, maybe? I saw that. These maps are big. This is... That's a piece of a page. Where are you supposed to be? I'm a pagey piece. I got torn up by capital B's and forces and thrown in this jungle. My other pieces have been scattered nearby. Please find my other three pieces. I'll be hurt again. You poor thing. Don't worry. We'll reunite you with yourself. <laughs> I've gone to find myself. If I, if I come back before I return, keep me here. <laughs> I was used to come in one piece. Yeah, that's right. Uh, I actually I actually got enough of the conversation to know what's going on. That's exactly right. We just made all this shit complicated. Hey. Yeah, hey. Back when I... Hey. Back in my day, video games didn't make things more complicated than they needed to be. <laughs> 
but what? What? Dad, get me that quill. I want the quill. But yeah. Anyways, so once again, um, I know the last episode was a little bit long. Well, I think I know how to get up here. Woo, that was close. So, I don't... Uh, I know the last episode was a little bit long, and I uh, definitely am still interested in knowing what you guys have to say about how long you want the episodes to be. So, definitely uh, feel free to let me know your thoughts in the comments below. I'm still kind of figuring this out as I go. Look at me go! Look at me go! I'm amazing! I'm amazing! I almost fell down. Maybe I can't do anything further from here? It's kind of hard to tell. I'll be honest, I'm not exactly sure where I'm supposed to be going. If there's one complaint I had about this game, is that it's a, it's easy to get lost. Now granted, they want it to be a free-roaming platformer, so I guess that makes sense that it wouldn't be as straightforward, because it's about exploration. But, you know me, I like having an idea of what I'm doing before I dive on in. Still, that's not, you know, it's not, it's not, I guess it's not a real complaint. Uh, I'm still, I'm still enjoying this thoroughly, but I am very lost, so I apologize if, while you're watching this, you have multiple instances of Dandy, what the fuck are you doing? Because that's probably going to happen a fair bit, unfortunately. Alright, well... You know, that'd be dizzying after a while. It won't be so long you could do that and just, you know, not lose your stomach entirely. Also, how quickly does that regenerate? Because I have no... It does look like the part... Yeah, there it goes, there it goes. Okay, wow, so you really don't need the butterflies unless you want to maintain your role while you're going through it. That's the only time you really need that... Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Look at those! I bet you we. I know those are berries. We gotta throw those berries down the road. Hey! Huh. Why does that vibrate when I'm inside of it? The fuck are Yuka and Laylee doing in there? They're making terrifying little children in there. That's exactly what's happening. Okay, I'm just. I, I'm, I'm mostly collecting quills right now because I'll be honest, I still don't know exactly what I'm doing besides, you know, looking for pages. Oh! Huh? Yeah. Oh. Oh, I gotta, I gotta feed this one. Uh, how do I feed you? Maybe, I, oh, this is probably a hint. This is probably a hint. Go inside the big freaking cave. That's your clue. Ah, Sam Adams pumpkin ale. Oh, this takes the edge off the throat. This feels good. Hey, there's a pea. Oh no, that's a whole damn thing. Um, hello? Good day, strapping adventurers! Splendid day for a hunt, what not? Whoa, aren't you supposed to talk simple? Run straight at us? Oh, like those Neanderthals in Ivory Towers? Absolutely not! I'll have you know, I'm the most aristocratic character in the game! <laughs> not likely. There's a guy with a huge ice palace in the next world. He must be loaded. I might you assist a gentleman with a modest light lighting quandary? This antique temple features a divine shooting gallery, but some louts blocked my windows up top. Might you find fellows climb my rooftop and unblock the windows? That seems like a task suitable of your hmm, statue. Well, fucker. We'll take a look. I lick you. This guy better hand over the pagey or I'm gonna coat these windows and something fireworks. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so I gotta I gotta unblock the um the roof then somehow. I don't know how I'm gonna do that. We'll figure it out. We'll get this. Alright. So first we gotta just find our way up. Let's get there. The fuck is this? Oh dear. What in the fuck? Huh. 
Okay, I'm not quite sure what that's supposed to have me do. It's a puzzle. I know it's a puzzle. I gotta find a way to hit the ground, I guess. I don't know. I'm gonna ignore that. Let's just go do this. Yeah, I knew it. Okay. Get up there, you little you animal. Oh, they broke it, so I can't do that. I have to... Oh, they're being... They're being assholes. Oh, gosh, I'm going through the flowers. I didn't expect that. SpongeBob, I found your mom! Where the fuck is she? Hey, kids, where could I get you? Uh, one, please. One tonic? You've got to present your company-approved ID card first, kid. Ivory Tower's employees only! Uh, 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 yes, uh, about that. My bad friend here ate mine. Blame the bat. I'll tell you what, I'll let you off just this once. We're all friendly colleagues after all. Yes, friendly colleagues. <laughs> he stands out with his hands on his hip. I assume it's a guy. My name's Vendy. I assume you're familiar with my game modifying tonics? Remember, each tonic you equip makes a big change to your rules of work. You need to complete a challenge to unlock each one, and no messing around. Only one tonic equipped at a time. Come see me when you want to swap them out. All right. Oh, I have to, un I have to uh, unlock these. All right. So tonics apparently give you certain abilities, and you just swap them? I guess they're just conditional ability modifiers or something? I have no idea. I'm completely lost. What's another sleeping dude? Hey, it's you! Are you gonna give me a new ability? If it isn't my old mates, please snap right into my office. What office? That's more like a crumbly old temple to me. Oh, uh, yes. Pay no attention. Top designers are in the case. A word when it's glassy stuff. This fuck, this motherfucker. Anyway, I take it you're here for some of Treasure's famous advanced maneuvers. Yes, please. We could really deal with some new moves, Trouser. Teach me some new moves, Trouser Snake. <laughs> just for you, my good pals, I'll teach you a real boss slammer for just 30 quills. Hold on, I thought we had a deal. We unlock worlds, you give us freebies. My free moves blow only in every tower, I'm afraid. In the town where it is business as usual. This asshole. Let me know which product you're after. We'll fill out your quiet forms. How many do I even have? I have 64. I'm good. Slurp shot. Sonar shoot. Super Sonic says to show secrets. Slurp edible objects and fire projectiles. I'll bet you that's, that's what the berries are for. I want to go with this. Yes. Oh uh, yes, prepare yourselves. This next move is really special, great moves. Go on then, spit it out. We've got magical books to fill. Well, if you stand in front of edible objects like berry bushes, you can press the B button to eat them. Great, right? Is that it? We could have saved these crawls for the casino world. Calm down, Lily. I'm sure there's more to this move. Yes, well, if you press the X button after eating, our green friend will spit out his meal as a slimy potato. <laughs> yes, Les. I suppose your next move will teach us how to pass wind. <laughs> well, actually. <laughs> Please tell me there's an ability where I pass gas as a chameleon. Oh, gosh. And the buddy slam. I'm curious about this one. Do you have choice? You should you move you after? Sure, why not? What's the move all about? Yeah. Uh, this move is such a stunning offer, I'm practically giving it to you for free. Yeah. Seriously, a price like this, I'm going to have to remortgage my house. Is that a battered old ruin, too? It is now! Lately, yeah. to perform Buddy Stay, I'm simply jump into the air with A, then press uh, left trigger to send our green friend here slamming towards the floor, causing massive damage. I'm probably going to have to dispense with some of the voices just to save on time. I'll do it in cinematics. Would it make more sense to have Lily do the slamming? <laughs> Not likely! Yeah, yeah, yeah. With Buddy Slam... Excuse me. Yuka will effortlessly smash through obstacles and foes alike! Yeah. Now, will you be needing accident insurance with that, my good mates? Actually... 
Nope, we're fine. Thanks, Wormy. Yeah. Alrighty, come back soon. I've got important call. Okay, so. I'll bet you anything. That's what I have to do on those buttons over on the, over on the corner. Aha! Hello, this. Spiffing job letting in some light so I can see up my target challenge. You can address all the three blocked windows. It would be splendid. All right, other three windows, huh? There we go. And... He said... Other... Oh, he said other three. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Capital work. I'm a side wall ranger sporting contest for a real prize. What the hell? Okay. Fine, then. We'll do your stupid challenge. I'm hearing all the breathing. Is that the guys down, down below? <laughs> Into the dark cave we go. Oh gosh, the atmosphere in this game. Uh, I also do apologize that my banter is getting a little bit weak right now. I'm a little tired. Uh, you may have noticed in the last video. My eyes are all kinds of baggy. I in the last the previous two nights I've gotten I think I've gotten to sleep like between three and four both nights. So I've not been getting good sleep. I'm tired. And my voice is sore, so give me a break. <laughs> Videos will get better from here on out, I promise. So thanks for clearing the windows up top, what no Whatever, we've done the dirty work, now hand over the pagey. What? Give me my posh paper, leaving me with just the local fauna, should nature call? No, unlikely. He's gonna use it as toilet paper. <laughs> Although I do like a sporting contest, I propose you take on my target challenge. I'll provide the targets based on my Neanderthal brethren. You shoot the blazes out of them all, and I'll surrender the page you want what. What do you say? Fancy a shot in my target range, chaps. Fine. Let's do it. That sounds fun. Let's shoot. Oh. Jolly good. You see, target lay down and don't forget your ammo. Do down the common beast. I'll award the pagey. Alright. Fine. Oh. 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 That's a few more. The blood is to blast. Alright. Ah, oh, you, you sneaky little bastard. Yeah, look at them go. How many of these do I even have? Oh, gosh. Oh. Got him! Ha <laughs> ha! That last one was a bit of a doozy. I was over a couple of run the mail peasants. I feel like I'm prepared to you to take on the rest of the corporate minions in the game. Go collect your reward. Yay! We got our pagey. I still think it's so stupid they call them pages. Yeah, I got two of them. All right. So, how many of these fuckers do I need before I can just leave, or does it matter? I honestly don't know. I'm, the, the, my overall objective is a little bit uncertain. I'll figure it out though, don't worry. I'm a strong, independent white male. I could do this. Figured it out. Damn it. Ah. Ow. Well, fuck you, too. All right, fine. I need butterflies. I need flutter bears. I'm not finding flutter bears. They're hiding from me. The enemies drop flutter bears when I kill them. 
Oh, I'm flying some enemies! Yay! Yeah! Oh, no, 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 no. Thank you. Alright, so. Um. Wow, well, we can do, we can do a bit more. Oh, gosh, how do I get up there? Look at that! How do I get up there? Hey, hey. Yeah. Hey. Let's go talk to this guy over here. You look like an interesting, trepid space explorer. It's a tentacle lady. Oh, goodness. Hello. Always expecting visitors. You must be the credit duo capital B is making all this fuss about. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm Dr. Puzz, Ivory Tower's top scientist. Well, I used to be before that dastardly Dr. Quack stole my research. I think you've been drinking too much of your own Kool-Aid there, madam. Psst, Yuka, what's wrong with her arms? Shh, don't, don't point out her differences. I'm sure she's kinky just the way she is. Uh, hi, Dr. Puzz, I'm Yuka. This is Laylee. Looks like you're experiencing some tentacle technical difficulties. The puns in this game. Everything's okay. Better than okay, even. I've just been tweaking my favorite invention, which has the has the magnificent power to transform. Only a damaged prototype was left behind after that horrible business with Dr. Quack, but it's now transforming as normal. Well, other than one small incident. I have an inkling of what that might have been. An inkling! I got it! If you find me, if you find me this world's molly cool, this world's molly cool, I can power up the DN Ray and help you on your adventure. The fuck? Uh -huh. We'll see, uh, see what we can do. You wouldn't even say that differently. <laughs> what the fuck? Come on, Yuka. Now you're just being a dick. I better not end up with barnacles, Yuka. Barnacles on your tuchus? Alright, so there's something. Oh, okay. There we go. Uh, there's gotta be like a ledge climb ability or maybe a third jump that I can do. Whatever the case. I really want to compete this. I really want to beat this one. Let's beat this one, then we can maybe leave this world. I need a hand. Someone give me a hand here. Now I need like an egg thingy. There it is. Oh shit, it's the wrong one. Damn it. Damn it! Go away, you fucker! I'm gonna get it! And one more, where's the last one? There it is. I just found it. Yay! I got it! So many shapes, it's a little easy to lose track of them. Oh, right, don't shoot me, don't shoot me! I'm just an innocent, you know, chameleon slash bat thingy. It looks like you found enough pages to expand a world! Yes! Okay, cool! So, oh, so that's all, all we do is just find enough little mini games until eventually. We can just get to a new world, so when you're ready, I'll explain some more. Well, excellent! In that case, I'm gonna make my way back, and we're gonna call the episode and wrap after that. Oh, yeah. hi. Hey. Hey. Woo! Butterfly? No butterfly. Whoa. I'm going to butterfly. Hey. Yeah, hey. Hey. Butterfly! Alright. Alright. There we go. All right, so let's go back home. Uh, I'm enjoying the atmosphere of this game, and I think I'm starting to get a hang for what the levels are all about. Um, it's, it almost reminds me a bit of Spyro. Uh, I don't know if you ever played those games, but in, in Spyro there was like a home world where you could there's a lot of free roaming, but then there were portals all about, and you had to unlock portals in different ways. In like Spyro 2, you had to get orbs. Spyro 3, you had to find like dragon eggs. I forget what you had to do for the first one.
I haven't played those games in forever. I really want to play the remaster when they come out. Uh-oh. You're back and alive. It seems that Snake Chap lost his bet. Yeah, wait, hold on, what bet? Those grand terms can be dangerous places, but it's good you're back. I have something important to share. The grand tomes like this one here can be expanded using the power of the pages you have found. Choosing to expand will make the book world bigger and full of extra challenges to discover. That sounds cool. How does it work? Once you've found enough of us pages, it's up to you. If you want to use them to expand a grand tome, you've already opened. Or search Hybrid Towers for a brand new one to unlock with us. Expand or explore? Yes, the choice is yours, and you can do this in any order so long as you have collected enough pages on your adventure. How exactly do we use our pages to expand a grand tome, Pagey? Easy, just step on the switch in front of the grand tome and press A. I'll tell you how many pages are required and expand the tome. To find the other grand tomes, look out for the helpful signposts as pages have placed around Hivery Towers. Got it. I guess we'll carry on our adventure now and decide whether to expand or explore. Simple enough. Okay, cool. So I'm going to save that for the next episode then. But to finish what I was saying before, that I do like the structure of this, where it's kind of like one big world and then you can like teleport to mini worlds. It allows the game to be expansive and creative in its own way, so it's not tied down to just one style and aesthetic. But anyways, here, I'm going to do this. So here, now we have our, our heroic hero's posture. Look at that. Heroic. I love it. So anyways, but I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to leave the episode there and uh, pick up in the next one. And I don't know. I haven't. I don't know if I want to expand or explore. What do you guys think? Should I expand what I've already gotten or try to explore into new areas? I'll let you decide. You leave your vote in the comments below. And I'll decide what happens after that. So that's pretty much all I've got uh, for this episode today. Lately, stop interrupting my outro. Fuck you, you little bat. <laughs> anyways, so that's all I got. So... Thank you, everybody, for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like, comment, share it with a friend, and I will catch you guys later.